basically. Cool. Yeah. Can you introduce yourselves and the role you do in the band? I'm Ian. Um, I'm Ali. Um, I'm the drummer. I'm James. I do lead vocals and lead guitar. Uh, I'm Lewis. I do rhythm guitar and I sing a bit. Um, where'd you get the band name from? Um, it, it, it was sort of just a, you know, a great cliche, there's death and there's royalty, because we used to be called Royal Blood before we got threatened with a lawsuit by Warner Brothers and Royal Blood. Um, <laughs> apparently, two, apparently two is bigger than four. Yeah. Um, but yeah, uh, so uh, we had to change, um, it's sort of Royal Reign, it's royalty. Yeah. Cliche and really cheesy, because cheesy metal call works. Yeah. But, so we, we try to keep the theme going. Yeah. If it works, I guess. Oh shit. Yeah, pretty much. Basically, yeah. How did you solve me? Um, well, I've known him for ages. Uh, we used to work for a promotion company that we did gigs for. Um, Danny, who was our bassist and no longer is, I've known him for years and yeah, years. Uh, he played today, but he left early. Yeah, yeah, he um, left straight after our set, basically. He's gone back to Leeds, Yeah. And um, what made you want to become a musician? If I wanted to make us become a musician, yeah. um, eight year old me, fire would get me onto the girls, and eight year old me as well. <laughs> <laughs> because 19 year old you now, as a child, uh, <laughs> and can do that. Teaser! Well. <laughs> um, yes. um, I tried so the so drums in two bands, you know, just to get double chances. Yeah. His girlfriend's <laughs> through there, so we shouldn't be saying that. I was bored, so I learned to play guitar. Um, and I, I enjoyed it. So I, I only started properly practicing after I joined. I, I, I taught me the basics of guitar. Yeah. And, I was recommended by our old drummer, who's here, he's lovely, um, to play in this band. And now I'm here at the show for some reason. <coughs> We, we haven't played many places to be honest, we're, we're, we're mainly a local thing until we got from next door, which we're going to put some I'd still say we're playing. Because, uh, because we've played Mega Scene twice. Yeah. Here. Not, yeah, here. Not, not, not here specifically. Even though I've had a few washout shows there, I've rather enjoyed Aspire in Raker. Just because when it's packed, it's packed. And it's, it's Probably because people are waiting to go out and they're just heckling. <laughs> yeah. yeah. And, and any publicity is good publicity, so yeah. And who are you musical then for them? I'm not. <laughs> just stop at that. Yeah. Oh, no, I've done. Um, I, I, I listen to anything really. Um, uh, I, I sort of grew up listening to classic rock and roll, so like Josh and Led Zeppelin and stuff. But uh, modern metal would be hard to go. The stuff we play is hard to go, Parkway Drive, like yeah. Snoops, all your generic metal fans. Yeah. I think for me the main thing is I, I love most music. I mean, I love blues, I love jazz. But um, for, for metal, probably Heart the Coward, Activist, Silosis, Devil Driver, that sort of thing. Yeah, it's a good one, for sure. Um, what's the best thing we've been about? There's a, there's a best thing. <laughs> honestly, for me, it's honestly for me, uh, the exercise. I don't get out of the house a lot, um, <laughs> and I basically sit at home playing Guitar Hero, which I'm better at than actual guitar. Um, I think yeah, just being on stage. To be yeah, honest. It's a crowd and show. Yeah, yeah. It's just, it's, 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 even if there isn't a crowd, we had one gig where it was pretty much a free practice. It was like three people. And we got paid. Yeah. We got paid for it, and it was still quite fun. Yep. Famous song to perform now. I, I, I probably say No Victims. <coughs> yeah. We open with today. So one, we open with the one hour EP opens with called No Victim, No Slave. Uh, just because it's, it's a big punch in the face and a big fuck you and a big solo at the end. So. A big cheesy slow rip off. Yeah, basically. yeah. <laughs> um, Favourite band you've performed with? Next Over. Next, next Over. <laughs> oh my god, Next Over. Uh, but from today it'll be Heart of a Coward. Yeah. I mean, yeah. We're, technically, technically, we're, we're technically, technically not playing with them, they're here today and they're playing on the stage above us, but I'm, I'm going to call that playing with them. <laughs> I mean, to, to be fair, technically we played with Barry tomorrow last year. But yeah. But we opened the main, we opened the uh, the smallest stage. We opened there. the whole day. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Do you have a fan name? A fan name? Oh, it is like believers and things. Yeah. Um, no, we don't have fans really. <laughs> <laughs> I have a fan in my room. Yeah. I mean, you biggest fan. Yeah. We have fans. Um, no, fan. we have a fan. A fan. We, we, we no, have, we no, have singular. No, we have fans actually, because yeah. that, that includes the one in my room as well. Man broke, so I can't use that now. I'm sitting in the middle of lots of time. Jesus so fucking Christ. My cats get in. It's, it's, it's a piss take. Sorry. <sighs> They're indoor cats. It's not good. Anyway, sorry. Who's the laziest in the band? You. Uh, I, I would say Danny, up until now. 
Um, but Danny's no longer in the band, so I'm going to take over that role. Yeah, and I become the creepy looking, yeah. <laughs> I look like a drug dealer, I'm going to do nothing in the band. Yeah. I've already started wearing the hat. Do you have any hidden talent you control the camera? Oh, fuck's sake. Yeah. Control the camera? He did this earlier on. Uh, he can beatbox. Really? Uh, the only talent I can do is like harp and cello, but uh, that's because I didn't have friends earlier in my life, so I learned them. He can beatbox. Yeah, I beatbox. Yeah, he is. Not leaving this for the day. I was more entertaining than I said. It's entertaining, more entertaining every time. Oh, yeah. It's the last time I'm doing it today. <laughs> I, thought, I thought it was fantastic when we did it at Splash before. And then Redco. Oh, yeah. oh god. Thanks. Any, any others? Um, I, I can't really do much without like, having a classical instrument, really. You can play piano, um, that's not that special. I, I, I can play a classical piano, cello, harp, I can play a saxophone, I can um, violin, viola. Yeah, I, I, I was a very lonely child living in the south of England. Nice. I needed this. Cambridge. <laughs> <laughs> it was the first band slash artist you saw live. Yeah. That's a good question, actually. Well, oh, mine is shameful as fuck. Oh, mine's worse. Mine's no, worse. no, no, no. What's yours? What's yours? My chemical romance. Backstreet Boys. Oh, oh, <laughs> what the fuck? Whoa, whoa. Um, I was five living alone. Also, if you're not the first proper musician. <laughs> Um, unfortunately, well, I wouldn't say my character on that team. My character on that team were good when I saw them, but that was on the Black Bolt team. Yeah, I saw them on the Black Bolt I would just stick with Backstreet Boys. Um, <laughs> and I also like it because I've seen like uh, Rush, Muse, Rammstein, all like the big bands of Shotgun. Hands down, the best band I've ever seen live. I cried. So fucking much during that set, but but it was Hailstorm, Shinedown, and Alter Bridge. So you know, I was I was in my element of cheesy middle of the road. Right? Fuck off! <laughs> you and your My Chemical Romance and Backstreet Boys. I've seen them both. Let's go. Come on. Don't brag about it. What was the first album you wrote? Uh, Original Symmetry by Muse, 2001. Massive up into Metallica when I was five. He wins. Black album. Metallica. Alright then, I think. Okay, and Justice for All, Metallica. It was the first one I probably loved. If you win a zombie apocalypse, you would die first. If I sneeze, my legs will snap. Yeah, they, they, they look at him, he's a twin. Um, I can yeah, run yeah. pretty fast, but I can't fight my way out of the zombie apocalypse. Yeah, um, I, I spent most of my time playing zombie games like Dead Island and, so and the, Dead Rising. I don't have the craft thing, so that using any effort. Is, 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 you can run something in. Yeah, 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 yeah. I think I'll be alright. I'll, I'll, I'll probably out of the box. To be honest, to be honest, you can bite me and I'll just live off my own flesh. I've got enough spare. It'll be fine. You do an impression of your favourite farm animal. Favourite farm animal? Uh, what was that? I don't think my I, I, it, was, it, was the si it, it was the <laughs> sigh of the farmer that hates his own farm. <laughs> I just don't, I don't like farms. Just, I smell, sold my shares in Apple and I'm doing this. They smell funny and I was at a farm before and got attacked by a horse. Uh, the only farm I've ever been to... Uh, <laughs> it bit my foot. Yeah, the, 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 it bit my foot and chased me with three electric fences. Uh, the, 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 the only farm I've ever been to, uh, a goat ate my jacket. Uh, but, but you I can do a good goat impression. Yeah. That's it. <laughs> That's also my sex note. So, you know, let's, let's, just, let's just go for that. I'm so sorry again. I'm sorry. It's bad that you've got to apologise so much for these fucking interviews. I've apologised so much today, for, usually oh. for you two, but, but now for me. I'm catching oh up. My God. I'm catching up. Next. Oh, <laughs> What's your favourite child line? I don't think I've ever used a child line. Um, um, no, no comment. Rose is a red, violet, blue. I've got a knife. Get in the van. <laughs> uh, yeah, no, I don't, I don't think I've ever actually used a child line. No, I haven't either. Usually, I make a knob out of myself, and someone laughs at me, and it goes from there. And then they laugh. Because you look 12, let's be honest. Yeah. I, 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 look like you're, I look like you're careful. What's your favourite dance move you do for the camera? I don't dance. Hypothetically, you do. <laughs> what would be your favourite dance? Oh, no, no, it's, it's awesome. We don't have to do it for the camera. Um, you know what? You, you, oh, no, no, I can't do it because there's only two people, and frankly, I haven't got any arm strength. I'm, I'm, a, I'm a lower body. You know what? Dirty dancing, the lift. Yeah, <laughs> we could do that. No, I, I, I like to do that with myself just to see how long I'd last before snapping. 
<laughs> Under the weight of my own ego. Wow. <laughs> Uh, I feel famous. This is a big deal for me. I was a stammer like Porky Pig. Let's go for that. If you could write one song in history, what would it be? Oh, fucking hell. That's Pac Bell's Cannon in D minor. I'd love to be able to have wrote that. That's, yeah, that's, that is just a masterpiece. Yeah, I love it. Uh, that's just my like that. Uh, I was going to say Chopin, but, but I'm going to go for. I'm gonna say I have no idea. I'm probably gonna say to let's know that James because I don't like Nirvana, but it changed music. I'll just say Mushroom. To be fair, if it was a modern song, I'd probably say The Truth Right Ahead. Oh, good. Why do I forget I know Would you rather have no hands, no feet, no nipples, and no belly button? No belly button? Um, I, I would say no belly button, but like without a belly button, we wouldn't have been born. We probably sort of need that. Okay, no nipples. Men don't need nipples. I'm okay. going to go no nipples. No, I mean, it, it, I, I, I'd look hilarious because I'm just a patch of fur. I can't that. see your nipples anyway. You yeah, don't have much fur on them. Yeah. <laughs> 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 Thanks, this is on camera. Um, yeah, just uh, yeah. I, I'm probably gonna say no nipples because there's no reason for me to have nipples. I'm gonna go and get. These are just switch shift questions. So right. Twitter or Facebook? Okay. Um, uh, I'd probably say Twitter because uh, I, I talk more on Twitter. I don't even really use them for the band pages. Um, Coke, Pepsi. Coke, Pepsi. Coke, Coke Life. It's a bottle of air. You haven't it's tried a it. It's a bottle of air. You asked this earlier on. Monster or Red Bull? Monster. I'd probably say Red Bull. Um, iPhone or Android? Android. Android. Fuck iPhone. Um, iPhone, just because I'm the only one here with an iPhone. Well, the mine has stopped working since the new one came out, so I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to change. Because my mine has turned to shit since the new phones came out. Do you spend your time on iPhone? Night time. And can you say the links to where to find you and your music and so um, Basically, just uh, go on Facebook, Twitter, Bandcamp, Sa uh, SoundCloud. It's a SoundCloud. Yeah. SoundCloud. Um, I would say MySpace, but we haven't used that for a long time because I made it recently as well. I, I made it after the name change. I haven't used it for a long time. I made it recently. No, no, I, I, I made it just so you know we'd, we'd have it there, just because MySpace is good for music. Well, one thing you can do is if you can type in "A Dying Rain" on Google, we are actually the only band that comes up called that. Thank God. So um, you can type it on Google, and that takes you pretty much everywhere you go. Yeah, because got uh, but because there's a lot of links to other people with the quotes. This is a dying rain or something like that. Then yeah. there's. The band, then there's the band Dying Fetus with like, you know, something rain. Yeah, then there's Die Artist Murder, Rain of Darkness, that's beside the point. Yeah, we're on we're on Google. First page of Google, we're on Google. You didn't, didn't even have to pay. You seem so proud of that. I am. I really am. To be fair, that's somewhere Royal Blood. I typed in Royal Blood and it came up with links to the Queen. You know, it was... Yeah, basically. Cool. Yeah.